guys, good morning. So the thing that is on my mind this morning is how darn scary it can be being an entrepreneur. Uh, I found out last week that the main consulting uh, client that I have for change management is ending at the end of December. And I, you know, I knew the contract was ending the end of December, um, but I had really hoped that it would go into 2021. I love this company, the people are amazing, and I'm really, really enjoying the work. And you know what? Uh, even though that contract is coming to a close, all that means is that I'm going to find the next great contract and have, you know, meet new professionals and do different work um, that is going to be equally fulfilling. And the, the thing is, and my husband reminds me of this when I start to get nervous about, you know, being an entrepreneur and having to go out and find that next gig to replace the last one. There's no guarantees in corporate either. I mean, I got laid off from my corporate gig. Um, and at least this way, I can choose, right? I can reach out to the people who I've built relationships with and just really work on building that book of business that I love doing. And so that's what I'm doing. Um, it's scary a little bit, yes, absolutely. And super exciting because as entrepreneurs, we really get to choose what that next type of work we're going to do, the companies that we want to work with, and uh, it just it just gives us more control. So, if you are an entrepreneur or if you have a side hustle, and it feels scary, try to focus a little bit less on the the fear side of it and more on the opportunity side, and it completely changes your outlook. I woke up this morning and instead of thinking, oh my gosh, you know, what am I gonna do to replace that contract? I thought, oh my gosh, I am so excited to see what comes up and what that next work I'm gonna do is. So that's what's on my mind this morning. Hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.